bourbon, rye and American whiskey is one of the fastest growing categories in the industry today and interest in the spirit as a collector's item is rising rapidly too. In the last five years we have seen a 600% increase in the number of American whiskies being consigned to our auctions and the value of them has increased by over 900%. Whiskey Auctioneer is the ideal platform for those new to the spirit and is the perfect place to explore, learn about and begin to build their collections. Today I'm going to share with you five whiskies that could help you get started with yours. Buffalo Trace Distillery is not just one of the oldest in America, but today it's one of the biggest names in the game and enjoys a legion of dedicated and passionate collectors among its fans. First released in 2006, the Buffalo Trace Experimental Collection has become a huge hit with collectors. The distillery's huge production and storage capacity has allowed it to play with its spirit over the years, and with over 45 releases, the series showcases the best results of these experiments, including unique mash bills, wood types and high-tech aging techniques. I'm a big fan of this range, as it highlights the forward-thinking approach of the distillery that already has a hugely important past. With so much to discover, this is an ideal starting point for any curious new collector. Another of America's historic distilleries is the one we know today as Wild Turkey. Its brand was launched in the 1940s and its no-nonsense marketing, bold whiskies and big flavours has made it a firm favourite with bourbon connoisseurs. The classic 101 proofs are the embodiment of this. The 8 and 12 year old versions may have been discontinued domestically in the 1990s, but they continued to be exported to countries like Japan where they contributed to the bourbon boom there that has proved so crucial to the resurgence of American whiskey in the 21st century. Heaven Hill was established following the repeal of Prohibition, gaining a foothold in the market by buying recognised brands that had disappeared after the 1920s. Today the distillery functions almost like a museum, having preserved many of America's best loved labels. Their own creations are no less important however. One of these is the Parker's Heritage Collection, launched in 2007 to celebrate their legendary master distiller, Parker Beam. Having sadly passed away in 2017, Parker's legacy with the company was his forward-thinking approach, and the series continues to honour his ethos by both celebrating his achievements and pursuing further experimentation. For me, this series is a must-have for any budding collector embarking on their journey into it. There is no name more ubiquitous in American whiskey than Jack Daniels, while the famous old number no. 7 brand may feel too commonplace to collect, the distillery has an incredible back catalogue of limited and special editions to seek out. Of particular interest is the gold medal series of the 1990s and early 2000s. These are great whiskies paired with unique aesthetics, often housed in replicas of bottles designed by Mr Jack himself. Each of the releases celebrates a different award from the early 20th century and highlights both the history of the brand and the deservedness of its reputation today. Willett is one of the most bankable names in the world of bourbon and rye. While the distillery only resumed production in 2012, its Willett family estate brand has been making waves since 2006, produced until recently using cast source from all over Kentucky. Willett's parent company are known for the depth and quality of the casks in their warehouses, and the bottlings they become are massively sought after. While the source of each cask is undisclosed, many will contain whiskey from some of America's most revered distilleries and are well worth investigating. Mostly single barrels, these bottles are rare, but enough releases are produced that they are still accessible to new or aspiring collectors. Whether to keep or to drink, every Willett family estate will be a talking point in your collection and may even go on to become a cornerstone of it. Hopefully you've taken some inspiration in my selections today. Don't forget that you can find these and a whole host of other bourbon at whiskeyauctioneer.com.